And this game has been 40 years in the making. You see all of the yellow t-shirts here on all of the seats behind me. There is a very important part of this t-shirt and you can see it on the back. It is the mark of the NBA Finals. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, this game is starting at 6 o'clock tonight. All eyes on Oracle Arena. The finals are going to be broadcast in 215 countries and 47 languages. That's the press here from around the world. The Warriors had their final practice yesterday, gearing up for the series of their careers. All this, this stuff's nice, but, you know, it's a big distraction for a lot of guys. So we're rooting just for that jump ball that we sort of blow on the ball, ball to be thrown up and... Um, I think our focus will, will then shift to the game. It's probably going to be a frantic three or four minutes to start the game. Um, hopefully not too many turnovers and missed shots, but generally that's how it happens in a final series. Team members will be using wearable tech out on the court tonight, monitoring players' movement, intensity, and acceleration. And that will help co coaches spot fatigue and decide when players need to be benched. Now, if you don't have tickets to the game, you can attend one of many watch parties around the Bay Area. 30 restaurants, bars, and theaters have teamed up with the Warriors. The team is donating part of the proceeds to local charities. You can find that list on our website, which is cbssf.com. If you want a ticket here, though, they start at around $700. That is for the cheapest. Some of these uh, courtside seats are tens of thousands of dollars, so you may be better off at a watch party or just watching it on the old tube. Live at Oracle Arena, Ann McAvitt, KPIX 5. Sit in your lazy boy. Okay, thank you, Ann. It is 6.01. New this morning, a high-speed chase through the Bay Area. Started at 11.30 last night. Vallejo ended with a crash in Martinez. Pickup truck hit the center divider Interstate 680 after running over spike strips. CHP says the driver then lit some papers on fire inside the vehicle. K-9 unit helped an officer 